Good afternoon, everyone. Hope you all are doing good. So I'm Shemara Panditaratna, the course coordinator at the Alliance Francaise de Condi. On behalf of this, on behalf of the team, I welcome all of you to our open day session. Unfortunately, the director, Nisara Tukas, is unable to join us today, but she did not forget to convey her greetings for you all. So the purpose of this session is to give you a taste of the adult beginners class, as well as to introduce the French Alliance in Candy. Many of the staff members are here with us today to present their work, and it is going to be a chance for you to talk with them directly, to ask questions if you have, and also to ask about the library, the upcoming cultural events and all. We will also be sharing some images of our brand new website so that you have the chance to experience the Alliance in Candy despite the lockdown situation. So yes, I think you can see the screen, okay. IF Condi is an active member of the network of French alliances, which unites all French alliances around the world. At present, there is a total of 832 French alliances present in 128 countries. French alliances are French language schools, as well as francophone libraries and cultural venues. With 376,000 French learners around the world in 2020, despite COVID, and a total of 8,300 trained French teachers, French alliances have direct links with the French embassies and consulates. We are also certified French language exam centers, qualified to provide official certifications such as DELF, DELF, TEF, that are necessary for you to study and work abroad in countries such as Canada, Switzerland, and France, of course. In other words, you are really lucky if you're here in Kandy or in Sri Lanka in general, because you have, uh, like once you have completed your French course, you will be able to take the corresponding exam directly with us. All French alliances have the status of nonprofit organizations with a committee structure. In Kandy, members of the executive committee are recruited on a rolling basis, and we are always looking for new blood to represent and share professional skills and networks. Most of the Alliance Francais staff in Kandy have been working with IFK for over 10, sometimes 30 years. So the team here at the Alliance Francais de Condi is very experienced and ready to answer any questions you might have regarding learning or teaching the French language or in relation to our events and cultural activities. And it is a very strong team, kind and easy to talk to. Thank you, Evangeline, for sharing the website. So like I pointed out earlier, we have some staff members with us today. So let's get to know them. We have Ms. Sandunika, the administrative assistant, Ms. Evangeline, the librarian and the cultural coordinator, Ms. Laure, representing the academic staff. We have 22 teachers, including two native French teachers and one francophone teacher who is here with us today. We also remind our administrative secretary, Ms. Teja, Ms. Aguila, the accountant, and Mr. Ronnie, the office assistant. It is true that most of these staff members have been working with the Alliance for over 10 or 30 odd years. And as the course coordinator at the Alliance with the Condi, one of my main tasks is to ensure that your course continues smoothly at our institute by working in a closer manner with the teachers and the students. So without any further delay, let's get the experience of a French beginner's course at the Alliance Francaise de Condi. So I kindly invite Miss Laure to take over the presentation for the next 30 minutes. Thank you. Okay, merci Shimara. Uh, bonjour Carmini, bonjour Sachinra. Je m'appelle Laure, uh, je suis Suisse et uh, J'habite à Candy depuis 2007, donc ça fait longtemps. Euh, 
I hope that you have understood a little bit of what I said. And if you didn't, that's not a problem because I mean, you, you are very beginners. And then also uh, because you can guess I mean, when we learn a language uh, from a book, it, it sounds very really boring. But when you learn a language with people and you try to express yourself and you will have a lot of videos and things like that in your course, then it's much easier for you uh, to understand because you are in a situation and you can see that I'm moving my hands and that gestures is a part of the natural habits of French speaking people. Uh, and uh, people in general as well. Okay, uh, now I will uh, just show you, I will, can I share my screen? It's okay, no? Okay. Talk. Voila. Alors, I would like to, uh, to start this uh, thing. I will put you here. I will put the chat here if you want to write any comments or anything. Okay, you can uh, wait, I will push this. Voila. You, you can say you, you can write it or if you have a question or something. Okay. Uh, now, when you learn a language, uh, don't think that it's only words, vocabulary, and grammar. I mean, when you learn a language, there's so many things around it. Uh, for example, you will discover a way, uh, uh, I mean, what is a language? Your language. Your language is made of what? Alors maybe uh, if I can just know, could you tell me, uh, Tachindra and, and Karmini, what is your uh, mother tongue? If you don't want to use the Mac, you can type it in the chat. Oh, I see Sachin Halle. Kamini, what is your what is your mother tongue? If it's not indiscreet, Singhala. Okay, I born Kohomade. Okay. Uh, then when I do this, I use this, and this is something very cultural. So your language is made of the experience of the people, is made of the habits of the people, and it's made of the culture of the people. So when you will learn uh, French, and if you learn also another language, it's uh, not only uh, learning to write and learning to understand and things, it's also an opening on a new world, the world of the Francophone people. And uh, I think this is important because uh, like that, you may be able uh, to understand them better, to understand another way of thinking, because the way we speak is quite of conditioning our mind. So maybe you will find it a bit uh, bizarre. You will say, oh my God, these French people, that's horrible. Uh, you, you, you might have these feelings sometimes, but you will be also discovering things that you might uh, think very interesting and, and that you want to know more about it. And I think this is why it's good to be at Alliance because Alliance, as Shema said, it has a very strong link uh, with the French embassy and with other embassies. And it allows you also to have a cultural uh, background because there's a lot of activities which are made. Ah, Satchindra, can you hear me? You are back, I see. Can you hear me? It's okay, can you speak? Hello? Or oh, if, if your mic doesn't function, never mind. Uh, I, I just had uh, your question, uh, a little question for you, sorry. Uh, so what is your mother tongue, uh, Sachindra? So Kamini told us that it's a singular. What about you? OK. 
Can you type it on the chat? I mean, mother tongue or the language that you feel the more comfortable to speak. Uh, oop, she disappeared. Hey, you, then we will know when she's coming back. All right, Carmenia, let's continue. Uh, when I introduce myself before, I say bonjour. Okay? What do you think? Ah, Sajaja, you're back. Hello. What, what bonjour means? What do you think? Hello. Yeah, it means hello. Uh, hello or good morning. We have, uh, it's more good morning because um, in French, we have these two possibilities, which is the formal uh, way of speaking and the informal way of speaking. I think uh, if I'm not mistaken, in singular also, you say oya oh, yeah, uh, for the uh, bit friendly and you say obey for very formal things. So you also have that in French. Okay, d'accord. Alors, then I would like today uh, that you learn how to say hello in French, how to say goodbye in French, and also how to say my name is blah, blah, blah. Okay. Hello? Yeah, hello, can you hear me? Katrina, are you okay? Hello? Yeah, I can hear you. I can hear you well. Mm. Okay, Sachina, tell me, what is your mother tongue then? Hello? Yes. yes. Can you hear me, ma'am? Very well. Can you hear um, me? I suddenly get disconnected, then I get, then oh. get connected. Oh, yes, yes. It, it, it happens very often with this uh, connection. It's always uh, sometimes it's well. And so I, I hope you will be able to hear us properly. Okay. Uh, okay. If you find it easier to type in the chat, uh, don't hesitate. All right. Okay. Fine. Alors. Yes, I can hear you. Oh, you can hear me. Good, good, good. Okay, fine. So, Sachinha, is your mother tongue singular? Hello? Hello? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, are, are you a student also? Actually, madam, then I am doing the Zoom lesson. You're doing the Zoom lesson. Okay. Uh, okay no. is, your, your name is Upeja? Is it correct? Upeja, no, sorry. I am Chamar Upad. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, right. Okay. Uh, and and uh, uh, are you with Sachindra also? Sachindra is not in my mind. My okay. name is Chamaru Patte. Okay. This is a different participant. Yes. Okay, because because it's completely sweet. Okay, welcome. Uh, welcome, uh, Mr. Ratwate. Hello. Okay, thank you. <laughs> right. Je m'appelle Laure. All right. Can you guess yeah. what I said? Uh, Je m'appelle Laure. Ah, nothing Laure, no? That, that is simple. <laughs> okay, so I just said my name is Laure. I'm starting right. Laure. Okay, right. okay, good, good. All right, now we will just, uh, can you see my screen? Yeah, I think I'm... Okay, good. Yeah. Right, alors, we were just, I was just explaining that uh, French, like singular, have different form uh, to say things. We have a formal thing, which is called okay. formel in French. Form. Uh, and then informel, informal. Uh, like your singular, oya oh yeah, and obey. Okay. okay? So when we form. are polite, when we are polite, like we will say 
Bonjour. Bonjour. Alors, I will try, I would like you to try to say bonjour. Bonjour. Yes, very good. Very good. Uh, yeah. Then, Gawini, can you try to say it? Bonjour. Bonjour. Yes, excellent. Very good. Uh, and then, uh, now, what do you think could be the second word here? Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. What could be the meaning of this? Yes, very good. Alors, the mean, uh, 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 le, let's see. Carmini, can you try also? Au revoir. Au revoir. Okay, great. You have great, great. Uh, very well. Uh, then, what, what do you think it means? When I arrived, I say bonjour, and now, what could it mean? Bye. Yes, it means bye. Yeah. Alors, uh, you don't say bye now. Huh? That's uh, just to learn. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you don't you don't leave uh, uh, right now because it just started. Uh, very fine. Uh, now, can you try to say this to each other? For example, uh, I will say bonjour, Carmini, and then you will ask. Mr. Atwate to say, uh, you, you, you will say it to him and he will say it to me. Okay, shall we try? Normally, when we're in the class, it's, it's easy, but we can do that on Zoom also. Okay, right. Alors, let's, let's try. Bonjour, Carmini. Bonjour, ma'am. Okay, now can you ask him? Hello. Can, can you can you remind your 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 name because uh, um, it's not corresponding to the thing. Hello. Okay. You see now. I want to ask him what is your name. So I will ask him. Comment t'appelles-tu? And this means what is your name? Ah, can you can you tell us the answer, please? What is your name? Yeah. And which means what is your name? Then yes, yes. Comment so comment t'appelles-tu? Alors then you will say je m'appelle. Alors this, this is for the. I have this here. Talk talk. Ah, là, 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 this is here. Okay, je m'appelle. But uh, we we will see that uh, in two minutes. Alors je m'appelle. Je m'appelle. Alors, what is your name? Uh, then, je m'appelle means my name is. Okay? Alors, can, can you say, alors, je m'appelle Laure. Comment tu t'appelles? Je m'appelle Chabre. Okay, very good. Je m'appelle Chamara. D'accord. Bonjour, Chamara. Alors, now, um, I just want to come back on the bonjour a little bit, and then we will try to say all this. Uh -huh. After you will have all the stuff to remember, you will have the head like this. Okay. Uh, if you look here, so we have bonjour, which means uh, good morning, and au revoir, meaning goodbye. And if you look at here, this is the French and maybe the Western culture to say, uh, to, to, to greet the people. You see, they are shaking their hands. Okay, so here in Singapore, it's more, more hygienic with the COVID, it's much better. You, you do like this, hop, like that, you don't uh, shake the hand and, and touch the other. But you see that in France, you have this uh, habit of, doing, of saying that. And here, this photo is in Paris, in the Quartier de la Défense, uh, uh, where the business, uh, that's the business sphere of Paris. Okay, so that was just a little information culture. Yeah, can you look at the down picture? Is there something funny for you in this picture? We have Mr. Obama and his wife, 
And they are meeting uh, the president, uh, that was the former president, uh, uh, Nicolas Sarkozy, and his wife. Uh, look at this. Is there something funny for you in that picture? Yes, informal. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And, and, and yes, so you see here they are rather formal, they are shaking hands. But the French president is using the French custom and he is kissing the cheek of uh, uh, Michelle Obama. Okay, so it's like a very friendly welcoming. And this is what is happening in France usually when friends meet each other. And when friends meet each other, meet each other they will just say, Salut! Salut! Salut. <laughs> Alors, yes, we, we don't pronounce the LDT. In French, uh, there's a lot of uh, letters at the end of the word that we don't pronounce. Okay? And then we just say salut. Salut. Yeah, don't salut. Salut. Yes, don't pronounce the T. Salut. Très bien. Très bien. Okay, very good. And, and then, uh, alors, yes. then when you say bye, you can say au revoir also. Sometimes revoir. they say, but if it's really, really close friends, you can use the Italian one. This is an Italian word and you say ciao. Ciao. <laughs> ciao. So you, you learn French and you learn Italian at the same time. It's fantastic. No, you have two languages for, for one. Great. D'accord. Alors, uh, so now you know bonjour, au revoir, salut, ciao. So you can distinguish a little bit if it's formal or if it's informal. Let's go for the next one. Hop. Toc. Toc. Voilà. Here. Oops, sorry. Here uh, we can see. Je m'appelle Alice. Voilà, je m'appelle Alice. And what do you see with Alice? Uh, can you guess from which nationality she is? To express some ideas. <laughs> Alors, here, look at the back. Uh, ah, what is this? It's do you know? Yes. Yeah, this is Switzerland. Yes, that's the Swiss flag. So she's a Swiss girl because uh, when you learn French, you have a great advantage uh, because it's not only for one country, it's for so many countries. Uh, in all the continents, you will find people speaking French. Uh, there's a, well, I mean, not exactly everywhere, I see Shamara saying yes, yes, yes. Alors, uh, in South America, for example, you can see, oh, no, no, they don't speak French. No, but they like to learn it because they are Spanish native and it's very easy when you're Spanish or Italian or Portuguese to learn French and, and vice versa also. Okay, so here you have a Swiss person, Alice. Je m'appelle Alice. My name is Alice. Okay. Uh, if I translate literally, I am called myself Alice, okay? But, but you don't care. My name is Alice, that's fine. Now, look at the second one. Alors, um, Carmini, can you read the second one, please, for me? It's je, how, what, how, how she's called. Je m'appelle what? Je m'appelle Claudia. Jean. Claudia, voilà, ok. Je m'appelle Claudia. Fine. Alors, can you guess where she's from? Je m'appelle Claudia. Great. Super. Très bien. Quand je dis super ou très bien, it means very good. Alors, uh, where she's from, Claudia? Do you know this flag? That's the very old uh, fleur de lys, which was belonging to the kings of France. Okay, the symbol of the king of France. But they kept it, these people, uh, because they love the old-fashioned French. And this is people from 
Québec, Québec in Canada, because Canada is a bilingual uh, country with uh, French and uh, English as official language. Mm -hmm. OK. Alors, après, comment elle s'appelle, elle? How the, what is her name, this one? Je m'appelle Fatou. Je m'appelle Fatou. Yes, Fatou. Can you guess where Fatou is from? She's from Africa. Oh. Yes, yes, she's from Africa. Great. She's exactly from Ivory Coast. Because uh, did you know, by the way, that Africa is the uh, continent where there's uh, more people speaking French? More than in Europe, more than in France. <laughs> because you have a lot of African countries, all the Western African countries, they, uh, they also speak French. Okay? So that's what, when I say you are lucky to learn French, because it's not only for France, but it's opening you the Canada, it's opening you the African countries. If you are in the business field, all these Lebanese and, and, and uh, Gulf countries, they, uh, like Syria and, and others, they use also, used to speak French and still a lot of people uh, uh, speak French. Myself, I'm from Switzerland. So you see also Switzerland is open for you. Once you speak French, it's easy. Okay, hello now, <laughs> let's see if you can remember the things we have done before. How you will say, Good, uh, good afternoon. My name is, and you say your name. Aha, do you remember that? Can you try it? Alors, uh, Shamara, can you start, please? Okay. Good afternoon. Jamie Apple Chamara. Ah, how do you say good afternoon or good morning? I want that in French. Autrement. Je ah. ne comprends pas. Bonjour. Oui, bonjour. And then, je m'appelle Shamala. OK, say it again. Good afternoon. Ah, c'est pas good afternoon. Bonjour. Bonjour. Ah, bonjour. voilà. Bonjour. Bonjour. And je m'appelle Shamala. Great. Très bien. Carmini, à vous. Oh, à toi. Bonjour. Je m'appelle Carmini. Très bien, super. Alors, this is easy. Now, this is easy. Now you remember, how do we say goodbye? Au revoir. Was... Au revoir, yes, very Bye. good. Au revoir, great. Now, if you are not formal, how you will, uh, how is, how you will say, hi, my name is Chamada. <laughs> Uh, uh, je suis désolée, il y a eu un, un gros bruit. Je <laughs> pas entendu. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, there was a big noise. I just... Could you repeat, please? Pouvez-vous répéter? How do you say hi? Yes, salut. And then again, je m'appelle Chamala. Okay. Hi, salut. Je m'appelle Chamala. Ok, great. Carmini, your turn. Salut, je m'appelle Carmini. Eh, c'est bien, très bien, très bien. And now, if you want to say uh, bye in an informal way, what you will say? That was easy. Ciao. Ciao. Yes, ciao. Ciao, can you say it? Ciao. Ciao. Okay, excellent. Oh, now let's see a uh, next stuff and like that you will, you will know a lot of things and after maybe uh, we will see if Shemra wants that we stop or not. Uh, alors, now here, I put you here in the middle, voila. Now something else, normally when you meet people you will ask, what is the question you will ask when you meet the people? How are you? Yes, how are you? Kahamade. Okay. <laughs> Donc, here is the way to say how are you in French. Comment ça va? You have it written here. And this is co, mon, and we don't pronounce this T. 
sa va. Como se va. Yes. Como okay. se va. Mm -hmm. then, then for the answer, we have two possible, uh, two possibilities. We have uh, the, the. Como se va. va. Como se va. Uh -huh. Como. Como se va. If you listen to me, do I say, Como se va? Or do I say, Como se va? Como se va? Ah, ça. yes, hein? ah, yes, you see, in French, when you ask a question, oh, 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 you up, raise your voice up, okay? So then, Como se va? Como se va? Ah, excellent. Camini? Como se va? Ah, yes, you put your voice up. Yeah, yeah, great, great. Super, très bien. Vous êtes très fort. You're, you're very good, very good student. Alors, now... Comment ça va? Comment ça va? Now, uh, let's see what could be the answer. Alors, you have the informal one. You will say, ça va, et toi? Va. Et toi? Et toi? So this means I'm fine, and you? Ça va, et toi? Allez-y, Chamala. Ça va et toi. Ok. Alors, uh, again, the toi is a question. You see, it's a question mark. So you have to raise again the voice. Ça va et toi? Ça va et ça toi? Va et toi? Oui, ça va bien. I answer to you. Ça va bien. I'm fine. I'm great. Ok. Now, that was for the informal. If you have the formal situation, this toi, which, which means you, is becoming uh, vous polite, okay? Vous is the polite form. So instead of answering ça va et toi, you can answer ça va et vous? Mm -hmm. Ça va et tout? Okay, alors don't et put et vous, just et. Et vous? Ça va. Et vous? Ça va. Et vous? Yes. Chamara? Ça va et tout. Ok. Alors, you, you pronounce a little bit that, but it's ok. It's fine. It's the first et lesson. Vous. No, you have time to, to polish it. Now, uh, maybe you won't vary the, vary the, the uh, everybody has accent. Anyway, you hear my accent in English, it's a horrible accent. That is the French accent, uh, you spoke like that. No, I, I'm just joking. But a lot of people, they, they are horrible. Don't say it to our director. They're horrible for foreign languages. Okay, they speak horribly. Uh, they speak English like that with a lovely French accent. Okay, so don't worry. Everybody has an accent. It's fine, it's fine. Now, if you want to uh, answer something different, you can say, ça va bien. And here, if you look at the little emoticon, you can guess, what does it mean? Ça va bien. Ah, ça va bien. Ça va bien. Okay. Ça va bien. Ça, ça va bien. Bien. Alors, what is the meaning? What do you think? I am fine. Yes, I'm, I'm fine. I'm really, really fine. Very well. Okay. Then if you just say, ça va, ça va, that means it's okay. I mean, it's normal. And then ça sometimes, va. and then, yes, you see the last one. Oh, ça va pas, ça va pas. Alors, when we speak, we don't necessarily put this n. Uh, but the correct form would be ça ne va pas. But when we speak, ça va pas. Au ah, secours, ah, ça va pas. Okay? Ça va pas. <laughs> <laughs> okay? <laughs> right. Alors, now I will ask you the question and you choose the answer you want. Okay? Ah, bonjour, Chamara. Ça va? Ça va? Ça va, ça va comme ça? Ça va bien. Ça ah, va bien? Ça va. Ah, ça va bien. Super. Oui. Oui, oui. Alors, et toi, Carmini? Comment ça va? Ça va bien. 
Ah, ça va bien. Très, très bien. Bon, super. Then I'm uh, very happy uh, that you remember that. Alors, let's see. Let's see just, uh, I will off this presentation. We will, and you will tell me what are the words you have learned and which one you remember, okay? Talk. Alors, tell me. Okay. Alors, Carmini, which words did you learn today? What do you remember? Bonjour. Uh -huh. Salut. Okay. Ciao. Mm -hmm. Ça va, ça va bien. Okay. Ça va et toi? Mm -hmm. Ça va et vous? Okay. Um... Quelque chose d'autre? Je m'appelle. Ok, that's very really good. Ah, je m'appelle, je m'appelle, oui. D'accord. Je m'appelle. Mm -hmm. euh, j'habite. Oui, j'habite. Alors, euh, j'habite. Alors, ça, c'est moi qui ai dit j'habite. <rire> On ne l'a pas écrit. Bravo, oui, ça tuera, très bien. Alors, euh, j'habite. Je suis désolée, je vous étais cachée. You were You were hidden from me, Sachindra. I could not see you. I'm very sorry. I apologize. Alors, yes. Alors, bonjour, Sachindra. Oui, ma'am. Bonjour, Sachindra. Oui. Ça va? Bonjour, ma'am. Ça va bien? Ah, mais vous parlez bien. Parfait. Very good. Very good. OK. Um, Chamara, est-ce que vous vous rappelez aussi de tous ces mots? Do you remember all these words? What are yeah. the words you will remember? Yes, all yeah. of them as well? Yeah. Ok. Bonjour. Uh -huh. Bonjour. Mm. Oui. Salut. Mm -hmm. Salut. Yo. Ok, ciao. Mm. Ciao. Mm. Jimmy Apple. Mm -hmm. mm. How are you? Ok. Travaille-vous? travaille -vous. Un peu, ça va comme ça. Ok, d'accord. Alors, vous êtes, bravo, vous êtes très bien. Fantastique. Very good. Ok. Alors, euh, Shemra, do you want that we stop here? Or... Ok, yeah, if, okay. Uh, everything is fine, yes, that's fine. <laughs> All right. Alors, merci. Merci. Thank you. <laughs> merci, ma. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Merci okay. beaucoup. Right. So, merci. Thank you, Laure. It was really interesting to see the way the participants uh, participated in the activities. So, yeah, that's nice. Right, now uh, time for us to check uh, the textbook or the manual that we use and your teacher used to get these ideas, I mean, these uh, activities. Okay, so I will share you my screen and I will show you the book. Okay. Uh, do you all see my screen? Yes. Oui. Okay, let's see. So this is a textbook that we normally use in our beginners classes, adult beginners classes. So the name of the textbook is Cosmopolit A1. Okay, so I will just uh, scroll down for you all to have a look at the book. So these are like explanations, you get the chapters. Mm -hmm. So the words that you used now are Leo, bonjour, are all here. So there are other things now, je m'appelle, you find that activity here. You know, you do listening activities in class, speaking. So we try all four competencies in our classes. So with this textbook, we have a workbook as well. So now you see on your screen, the workbook, which is Cosmopolit Evan, Cahier d'Activité. All the little, little activities uh, that you can try are here in this book. So let's just have a glance. So you see, uh, fill in the blanks, listen and write the answers. So, yes. Now, for both books, the textbook and the workbook, you get two booklets. So, for the textbook, this is the booklet you get with the transcriptions. And here you have the transcriptions plus the corrections that you get in the booklet for your workbook. 
So at home, when you're free, you can uh, play the CD and listen to it while reading the transcription. And in case uh, if the teacher or y'all, you didn't try one or two activities in class, but you think, ah, I need to try it. So in that case, y'all are free. You can try those uh, activities in the workbook and get it corrected uh, on your own because you have this uh, answer book as well. Okay. And then you get uh, one CD for the textbook and another CD for your workbook. And when you buy the book, you get free access to a series of online activities, auto-corrected activities that you can try after each unit or after each lesson even. And when you follow the French general courses, it will also help you to get a better note, uh, like a better result, you know, um, in your O-levels and your A-level examinations as well. So it's not only for, you know, delf delf exams, but it will also help you for your A-level and O-level exams. Now with this book, we train you all for the DELF A1. Now I told you like we have the DELF exams here. So those are like diploma certificates like that you can get from the French Ministry of Education like to validate your French level because we are not uh, francophone. Uh, we are non-francophone people. So to validate, to say I have this level in French, you can take up the DELF exams. So with this uh, book, we prepare you all for the A1 level. You have different levels, but since it's the beginners uh, courses that I'm talking about, I'm sticking to A1. And then uh, apart from the French general courses, like I told, we have uh, A-level and O-level classes as well. Then we do seminars uh, along with the government school teachers who are also going uh, for paper marking as well. Uh, yes, Sachindra? Ma'am, I just want to know about this take fix exams for Canada immigration. Okay. Um, yeah. What is the exact thing you want to know? <laughs> to, to make uh, it like, yeah. <laughs> yes, Sachinra? Uh, about the classes and about the levels, we should have the uh, is it similar that that is the data fix times are similar to these state fix times so uh, likewise. no it's like um, here we like normally for when you want to take up a TAF exam like a TEF exam uh, normally the candidate say us like says us like I want this level like you have these levels uh, yeah one, I want B two ah okay so then in that case we check for the uh, delf levels and then only we give you we offer you classes like first you have to brush up your language and then we give preparation classes uh -huh. for the tef that's how we do uh -huh. so can we take them individually uh, we do offer online? individual classes yes yes we do offer individual classes but for that i think if you can leave your contact details on the chat uh, like we can get back to you after the presentation to give you more details Okay. 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 Right. Okay. Uh, so yes. Uh, and then now, as you all know, we do classes online. We do classes through Zoom these days. So we have integrated an online platform, which is called as Apple Learn, to make the classes more interactive. So I think you can see my screen with the Apple Learn page, or not yet. We okay. Let's see. So this is the ongoing A1.1 class uh, page. Okay, so with the help of Apple and the teachers are able to add uh, the class recordings because since it's done through Zoom, normally we record the classes. Uh, though all students are there or not, we record and we send the link. So the teachers can add the link on Apple and add homework on Apple and other documents. And like you can see here, uh, you can get to know the latest updates, like, you know, the cultural events happening. So it, it's really like, you know, even after the class, you can be in touch with your friends, with your teacher. So that's our aim as well. And we even tried the term in tests using Apollo. So you can see uh, different uh, posts about the literacy month. So these are the latest updates we get happening at the Alliance. And then like you can see here, the teachers can add, you know, the class summary, the class link, other details, the next class or the test details, everything. And also the homework, as I told you, the war homework, 
And if the homework is to send a voice clip, you can do it through Apollon. You can record your voice and send your answer. If not, if it's a writing text, you can attach your document and send it to your teacher. So it's really easy. So it's a little, you know, glimpse of Apollon uh, because we don't have much time to go in detail. Right. So I think like, you know, joining classes helps you to like, you know, develop your French, but it's not only, you know, working with the textbook and just waiting. No. Uh, by reading books, by listening to music, songs, and then reading comics, other newspapers, also you can uh, improve your French knowledge. So now I will invite uh, Ms. Evangeline, the librarian and the cultural coordinator, to talk about the library, the Candy French Library, and the exciting cultural events that we have, because uh, Alliance Francaise is the place where language and culture meet. Okay, so over to you, Evangeline. Thank you, Shemara. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I hope you all are doing well and being safe. Uh, my name is Ivana. I work at the Alliance Francaise de Candy as the cultural coordinator and librarian. I am here to explain you all a little about our cultural events, our library, and culture tech. Okay, so uh, about cultural events, Alias Francis de Candy is not only a language center, as Shemara said, it is also a cultural center where you get to enjoy the French and Sri Lankan culture. Uh, we here at Alliance Francis de Candy organize a minimum of per month, such as a traditional celebration, like for example, we have the Aurudu festival, we have uh, Pongal, we have uh, uh, Christmas, we also even organize um, Halloween uh, during October. So we organize all the cultural celebrations. Uh, also we have exhibitions as such as arts, photography, sculptures, all those ex exhibitions as well. And then we have the Sunday movie club, okay? So every, I mean, every month in the first Sunday or the last Sunday would be the uh, Sunday movie club where we uh, screen a French movie uh, every month. So yeah. Uh, so due to the current health situation, we have moved all our events online, okay? So now we are organizing exciting contests and movie days and everything is online, okay? So um, here are a few contests that we organized during the past few months. Let's share the posters and um, yeah. Okay, so here you are seeing the poster of the uh, online karaoke contest, okay? Our online karaoke contest was a great success. It was an international contest involving the public of alliances in Sri Lanka and in Maldives, okay? And uh, we are so happy to uh, say that the winner of this contest was from Alliance Francis to Candy. And uh, it was really, really a great contest. We had a uh, contestant all over Sri Lanka and even from Maldives. It was really a great success. And um, the second event is uh, the yoga event. <clears throat> Yeah, okay. so this is the yoga event that we had. So the International Yoga Day of 2021 was celebrated uh, in collaboration with the Assistant High Commission of India in Kandy and Ayubom Yoga Institute. More than 100 participants from all over the world took part on this event. It was an online event. And we had participants from India, from France, from all over the country. It was a great, great success. We had like a minimum, maximum of, I don't know, but we only could accept 100 people in our Zoom. So there were like 80 people waiting in the waiting room, you know? It was a great success again. And then it was um, the environmental day. So, um, yeah. Environmental day. <clears throat> okay, great. So this was the environmental day poster. 
we celebrated the environmental day uh international environmental day with the, with two social activists in kandy okay uh, which was a very useful and an important topic to be discussed uh, the event was a great success it drove us uh, to a few steps closer to become a green alliance you know recycling and uh, cutting off of pollutants and you know how trash is being collected in the ocean and how it is affecting the marine life so all this it was very useful and you know with the um, oil spill of the um, ship that burned it was really a great um, discussion so we organize all kind of discussions online discussions you know like important topics stuff like that and we record most of our events and we share them in our youtube channel and our also our facebook okay so do take a look at them and uh, you can have an idea of how these events go okay and uh, do subscribe to our youtube channel so you can get uh, all the events you know if you didn't have a chance to participate in the event you will have a chance to watch it okay uh you can find our monthly event calendar online in our website uh, or you can subscribe to our newsletter and uh, to get delivered day you know directly to your email uh, all our events and what is happening contests not only events like you know uh, registration day exams all that okay so if you have any question regarding cultural events do not hesitate to contact me uh, i will be more than happy to answer all your questions i will post my i will put my email address in the chat box so you can contact me anytime just you know type a message an email just send or you are um, you can ask your question in the chat box i will be more than happy to answer okay so this is about our culture i can talk forever but you know we have very limited time so yeah i'm going to move on to the library uh, so thank you shamara and uh, for sharing the screen <laughs> okay so library now uh, the candy li french library is where you can find all the reading material you need where you are uh, whether you are an a1 a beginner level or a c2 advanced level for every age from children's book you know uh, to french for uh, professionals you will find all the resources and tools to help you make independent progress in your french education once we reopen afk uh, you are more than welcome to pay a visit to our library and enjoy all the collections however you should be to specific services such as borrowing books magazines dvds and e library access you know if you want to become a library member please contact me and i will guide you uh, again you can send me an email okay so <clears throat> and that is about the library and that cultural check in meanwhile you are very lucky because afk is the one of the few alliance french alliances in the world to offer access to cultural tech uh, which is completely <laughs> Uh, you will find more than 80 magazines 300 and um, sorry 35000 books 500 movies 1500 pieces of french music are available okay let us show you around a little bit how um yeah culture tech work okay so uh, this is the web page this is uh, how the website looks you can find all the uh, latest news you can read the news um books i mean from beginners level to you know like advanced level uh, from children's book from comic strips i mean you can listen to french music french movies and all these are in this website okay but as you need like for example if you want to read a french author's book you just come here and type in the name of the french author you can find all the books you need and here we have the uh, kit section this is the uh, comic books okay so everything you need to learn and to read is you can find it in this website okay now okay so uh, the good news is that it is possible for you to become a member of the French uh, Candy French Library and enjoy a full time access to Culture Tech, a free and from anywhere in the world for you to access it. Okay, for this you do not need uh, to register as a student. Okay, so you don't need to register as a student. You can contact me. Please contact me, and I will be more than happy to help you out with the process of membership. Okay. 
this is it. And if you all have any question regarding cultural events or our library, do not hesitate to contact me. And uh, thank you so much. Uh, thank you for your time. I hope the information I shared was helpful. And it was a great pleasure talking to all of you. And uh, OK, so thank you. It's over to Shemara. OK, thank you, Evangeline. So if you have any questions, huh, she'll be there until the end of the session. So you can uh, drop her a message uh, or you know you can ask by uh, unmuting. Right, so now that we are coming to an end of our open day session, I myself and Sanunika will be, uh, will be giving you uh, some details about our beginners courses. So we are going to start off with the weekend course and I will share my screen. Bon. Mm -hmm. Right, so I hope you can see my screen. We oui? okay. Right, so this is the weekend French classes. Like normally at the Alliance, we have uh, four terms. Each term divided like having three months. Uh, but in generally, like for a term, we, we do uh, 10 weeks. We do classes during 10 weeks. So likewise, we have four terms now huh, for y'all, like for the beginners courses, we have different codes that we have added, huh, like A1 course, it's for the first term, it's A1.1, second term, A1.2, third term, A1.3, and fourth term, A1.4. So likewise, this week, uh, weekend beginners course is a one-year course. Okay, but if you want to join the, to the Alliance and then just to know about, you know, like get to know about the basic French or to get the basic French knowledge, you are free to come and join, you know, maybe only the first term or until the second term. So you can decide. But if you want to complete the whole A1 level, you have to continue the whole one year course. So the whole one year course is to get the A1 level, get up to the A1 level. If not, if you want just the basics, you are free to join maybe one or two terms. We have students who, does, who do that. So yes, these classes are happening on Saturdays and Sundays from 3 to 5.30. For the moment, we have planned these classes online. Like you all know, we all know the, the situation is difficult to have on-site classes. So the first day that we have planned is 2nd of October, which is a Saturday, and the textbook that we use for this class is Cosmopolit A1, the textbook that you saw a while ago. Okay, the books are available at our office. You know, like we do courier books these days. Okay, so I invite Miss Sandunika to give uh, an idea or more detail about the prices. Thank you, Ms. Shimara. Hello, everyone. Nice to meet you all. Hope you all are doing good. So I'm Sandanika, the Administrative Assistant at the Alliance Francaise de Henley. For the weekend beginners class, monthly payment is rupees 4,700, but the students needs to make the payment per term for three months. The payment per term is rupees 14,000. At the first registration, the student needs to pay the term payment plus the admission fee of rupees 2000. For this A1 weekend course, you need to buy the textbook Cosmopolit 1, which is rupees 6000. The students can buy the textbooks from my administrative office and be couriered to your doorsteps with additional charge of rupees 300. So I will be sharing the bank details with you in chat. Okay, then thank you so much, Shemaras. Over to you. Thank you. So at the Alliance, we don't have just one uh, course. Huh? We have uh, other courses as well, you know, other options. So in case you all are not free during the weekends, you can join our intensive course. So now I will be sharing my screen again to show you some details. Okay, there I go. Mm -hmm. So I think you can see the screen. So these are intense, this is the intensive beginners course, which is a six month course where we use the same textbook, but the classes, since it's an intensive course, classes are happening from Monday to Thursday. 
from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. And as I mentioned earlier, you know, the classes are done online through Zoom. The starting date that we have uh, here is the 27th of September, which is a Monday. So though it's a six month course, like I told earlier, you can select whether to come, uh, you know, uh, just one term or to complete the level. Uh, you, you can decide if you are to complete the level, you have to follow the whole six month course. OK, and I will uh, get Sanunika to uh, give you the price details uh, for this course as well. OK, so. For this intensive course, for the six months course, per month payment is rupees 12,000. Actually, this uh, intensive course is a special one in this course you need to make the payment monthly so per month it's 12,000 rupees at the first registration the student needs to pay the monthly payment plus admission fee of rupees 2,000 uh, for the six months course also you will have to buy the same textbook cosmopolitan one which is 6,000 rupees this textbook can also be couriered to your doorsteps and can be collected from my administrative office so thank you so much, Amaris. You can take over now. Okay, right. So before ending the session, let's have a little Q&A. So if you have any questions, you all are free to ask. You can unmute and ask. You can speak in all three languages in like Sinhala, English or in Tamil. We have staff members who are speaking all three languages. So please feel free to ask your questions. And uh, in the meantime, Sandunika will be adding the contact details as well to the chat so that, uh, you know, you can contact us even after the session. And then I saw one question here about the recording. Yeah, we will have it on YouTube and then the link will be posted uh, on Facebook, on Instagram, like, you know, all our social media pages so that you can check it afterwards. Mm -hmm. And okay. And uh, I'll put it down. Mm -hmm. Any questions? No. Yes, Chamara? Nothing special, madam. Okay. Okay, <laughs> right. Yeah. Right, right. Okay. So. There are no more questions like, you know, uh, earlier we had Sachindra. Uh, fine, then, okay, you can note down our contact details, uh, you know, our uh, email address is there, phone numbers are there. So you can, if after the session, if you have, suddenly if you have a question, like you can ask from us huh? and we will be happy to answer to you all. Okay, so with that, we are coming to an end of our presentation. Uh, so I thank once again, like everyone uh, for taking part in the session. And it was a great pleasure to the Alliance Française de Condé to have shared this moment with you all. And I also thank our team members for joining the session. And then uh, before leaving you, please feel free to say, you know, like uh, tell us how the session was because that's also important for us to know how it went. And then I hope to see you all the next term. Hmm? <laughs> okay, then, right. Thank you so much. Have a Thank nice you. afternoon. Au Take care. Au revoir. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you.